It is time for January 2020. And did you know that there are certain foods you can actually eat to fight sickness and disease? Please welcome the author of Eat to Beat Disease, Dr. William Lee. Good to see you. Hi, Dr. Lee. Very uh, fantastic. Yes. Yes. I love a cravat. Yes, very it's nice. Fabulous. All right, apples. Apples. An apple Tell a us day about apples. What? Apple day is supposed to keep the doctor away, but mm -hmm. most people peel their apples. Of course. Oh. I'm saying that the new research shows the peel contains a natural chemical called resolic acid. Mm. Good for circulation. Yes. Good for your heart, your brain, muscles, anything you need so to do don't that to peel better. the apple. Just eat it. Is it better to just eat the peel? Skin. No, no. Well, you know, eat it with the skin. Yep. Wash, and then also make sure that organic's best. Okay. Yes, organic's right. best. That's right. right. Now, this looks like heaven. Who needs another reason to love chocolate? I'm going to give you one. Okay. The new research shows that chocolate actually mobilizes your, activates your stem cells so you can regenerate from the inside out. No kidding. Yep. And research shows that just having two cups mm. of dark hot chocolate, which you can make with almond milk with a little vanilla for sweetener, yeah. actually is enough to double the number of stem cells. you got to taste it. So you do but you could do this without sugar, okay? I mean, how do you do yep. without sugar? A little vanilla will make it sweet, vanilla. a little maple syrup, syrup honey, that is natural. delicious. It's amazing. I love how dark it's it is. It's delicious. Too. Yeah, real chocolate. And so can you, use, can you use milk chocolate? Or no, just dark chocolate. Dark chocolate's best. Okay, but what What if you only have milk chocolate available? <laughs> Stop, get out of your treat bag. Sorry, I'm getting out of the store. store. Okay, okay. Pom pomegranate. Eat, these, this is my crunchy snack. I like it as a crunchy Listen, snack. Listen, uh, pomegranate is great, packed with antioxidants. Here's the amazing thing is it's good for our gut health. It helps mm. our gut grow one bacteria called acromancia that actually helps fight cancer. Uh, I keep hard hearing to, more and more about good gut health. Hard good to actually so hard important. to actually eat these little berries. All you need is eight ounces of pomegranate juice. I swig it down as a shot with my cup. And so, and do you make it yourself? Because getting into a pomegranate I just, is like solving the Rubik's I cube. I just, I, I just get sure. palmful pom test pomegranate right. juice. Mm -hmm. Kiwis, one of my favorite. Cut them up for breakfast. You can put them, make them into a smoothie. Mm. The studies have shown that one kiwi a day, it's all you need, can protect your DNA by 60% from damage from the environment. Sunshine, off-gassing, toxic fumes, gasoline. You mean it has like a youthful look? Yeah, it keeps you, slows down cellular aging. Definitely eat it. Okay, we'll, we'll take these. Mm -hmm. And then finally, <laughs> Grandma always told us, Mom told us to eat broccoli. Mm -hmm. But these are granny broccoli, these are the, the adults. They have substances that boost your immune system called sulforaphanes. Mm. The baby broccolis, which you can get in the store now, these are three to four days old, they have a hundred times more of the immune boosting stuff. Uh, we shall eat you little baby broccoli. You, you just, you just feel the maze, you like it? You gotta try it. It tastes like nuts. Cheers. 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 Okay. Okay.